Welcome back. The Flathead Valley is home to the only mosquito control drone in the state. MTN's Marin Sue got a look, a closer look that is, at how this modern tech works. Don't worry if you see this drone flying around in the sky. It has special technology to detect and repel mosquitoes. We plan on basically using that as we would any other form of uh, treatment equipment. We first go out and do a survey to see whether mosquito larvae are present in standing water habitat. Jake Rubo is talking about this brand new mosquito controlled drone. So far this year, mosquito activity looks low. We haven't had the extensive flooding, so we've really been able to target our efforts and, and keep them under control in most places. And that's where the drone comes comes in. Using technology similar to Google Maps, Rubo flies this drone checking for mosquito larvae. If detected, a pesticide safe for humans and the environment is sprayed, keeping mosquito populations at bay. While mosquitoes can be annoying, Rubo reminds people that they do have their place in nature. They serve as a food source for a lot of other insects, um, obviously frogs, birds, bats, things like that. Um, they can serve as pollinators. Don't be surprised if you see the drone flying overhead. However, there are strict guidelines. The drone abides by FAA rules and can't fly over your property without your permission. If you're concerned about mosquito bites, Rubo suggests wearing long sleeves and pants as well as mosquito repellent clothing. In Kalispell, Varn Sue, MTN News. And Rubo says he plans to take out the drone next week to check and spray for any mosquito larvae.